testing, testing, cork town. How do we want to do this? Um, what's up, people? I don't know. Action. This time of Fresh Air, we check out cork town. So it was um, June 4th. When was that? 2017. No. Yes. yes. It was super warm out. The sky was blue. The temperature was a balmy 74 degrees. And uh, yeah, we were down for a little adventure. Corktown is just west of downtown Detroit and it's just a stretch of Michigan Avenue that has a lot of bars and restaurants and some pretty cool homes and then the famous abandoned train station and as we're walking down the street filming this guy runs out of a barber shop hey what are you guys filming what are you working on and he invited us in and gave us a tour of this barber shop that's only been open for a month now Everybody at the barbershop was really pumped because Tim Meadows. So how about I come over there and go to town on your money and on your ass? Oh right, Tim Meadows. Tim Meadows was just in. I guess he's a Detroiter. Man. Yeah. Yeah. It's beautiful inside. It looked like they had a lot of talent there too. Yeah. So uh, we continue walking down, heading east, and we stop at Otavo Via for a pizza and some gin and tonics. Mm -hmm. That place was so nice. It was fancy. Otavia is one of my favorite spots in Detroit because they just have some killer Italian food and bocce ball and back. And we were celebrating your birthday, so it was kind of an occasion, too. What is love? What is this longing in our hearts for togetherness? Is it not the sweetest flower? Does not this flower of love have the fragrant aroma of fine, fine diamonds? Does not the wind love the dirt? Is not love not unlike the unlikely not it is unlikened to? Another favorite spot that I had to show Toby was Motor City Wine. Mm -hmm. That place is cool. That's true. So we're gonna find that. Just try not to have eight gin and tonics. Motor City Wine is this super cool bar that normally has live music and they have a great selection of wine and beer and they have this epic patio on back so summertime it's a great spot to go for wine and meet a lot of the locals in Detroit. Yeah, they have bocce ball there too. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so since we already had a little buzz, we just grabbed a couple beers and decided to play some bocce ball. He taught me, I'd never played before. Mm -hmm. My sister Ashley had the night off from Isabel, so she came out and had a beer with us. It was so good to see her. Yeah, so neither Toby nor Ashley had been to Sugar House before, so I had to show them that place as well. So, what did you get? Water. <laughs> <laughs> I was really insistent on being the DD because it was your birthday and I wanted you to have a good time and I wanted Ashley to have a good time because I know she doesn't get out super a lot because she is a full-time mama. So, I just wanted you guys to enjoy yourself, but I did take a sip of both of your cocktails and they were amazing. That's my first time trying absinthe too. <laughs> So yeah, if you're looking to get out and do something in Detroit, Corktown is an awesome spot to check out. You can go and grab a drink, go to the train station, take some pictures, and I mean you can walk the whole strip and bar hop. Oh, I totally should have peed while I was in there. Oh, no. Got it. <laughs> <laughs> if you like content like this, be sure to like and comment and subscribe.